Retirees are actually having to go back to work right now. We're going to show you how to avoid that. Check it out. Ryan here with your weekly Money Minutes. Hello. <laughs> it's another gorgeous day out here in New York City. We're actually in front of the New York Public Library today. I always, make, I always think of the movie Ghostbusters when yeah. I think of this. <laughs> it's, it's the perfect scene. Um, and today we actually want to talk to you guys about an article that recently came out on the Wall Street Journal. And it's specifically talking about GE and a lot of employees who retired on GE stock are actually having to return back to work because the stock has lost so much in value they're not able to stay retired anymore. Yeah, and this is a perfect example. When I started in the business almost 20 years ago, not to date <laughs> myself, um, you know, GE was like was the stock that you could own. Everyone used to say you could own GE and you were set for life. It's the oldest American company that trades yeah. on a public exchange. And that's clearly not been the issue. The, the stock has done poorly, yeah. it's lost a lot of value, and, and they're not in great shape. Exactly. And yeah. the crazy thing is it's really not an anomaly. This happens from time to time with big companies that we never think it's going to happen with that's people true. are retiring off of. And you can probably speak to this, we've talked about this before, but you worked for Merrill Lynch and they had the same thing happen, right? I lost a lot of money in restricted stock. I'm still bitter. <laughs> I still haven't gotten over it. But no, I had a lot of friends who lost literally their whole net worth by owning that yeah. one stock because it went to almost nothing in the matter of six months. Exactly. Yeah. So it's really just a reason why you need to make sure you're properly invested. You're not just dependent on any one company or even just a handful of companies. So whether you're just starting out, especially if you are nearing retirement, definitely have somebody look at that for you and make sure you're set up so you're not going to be in that same boat. Yeah. If you want to learn how to get diversified so you're not dependent on one company, you can talk to a real financial advisor. Simply click on the link above or below. Um, you can talk to one of our Pink Capital investment advisors or you just want to get our weekly, timely, insightful content. <laughs> <laughs> Self-proclaimed. Just click on moneyminutes.com. You can subscribe and get our weekly content. That's this week's Money Minutes. As always, be, be bullish. bullish.